guys, what is up? Iron Reaper 92 and today I'm making a video on everything you need to know about the robotic drone in 7 Days to Die. Now first and foremost, there's a rumor on the internet that these guys can actually aid you in battle, they can actually fight zombies, and that is not true. It's an idea that was scrapped about 5 months ago by the devs, and that's why there's information out there about it, but... Um, after viewing a few online forums and uh, checking some stuff out, I realized very quickly that that is not actually in the game. I've also tried loading it up with all different sorts of ammo, weapons, and it just doesn't work. Um, so with that out of the way, let's get into it. So the robotic drone is a craftable drone once you reach a certain level in science. You can also find them, and they're incredibly useful. They have three basic mods, and we have all of them on this one. The robotic drone's durability actually depletes as it's being used, so I don't believe it actually takes damage, but as it's being used, its health continuously goes down. All of these are craftable after you find the recipes for them, but we have the robotic drone morale booster mod, which is hilarious, the teddy bear head. This increases stamina regeneration by 10% when near the drone with this mod installed. With um, all your perks max and stamina, this is insane. You basically have almost infinite stamina. And then we have the most useful one in the game, which is the Robotic Drone Medic mod. This allows you to actually put healing items in the drone's inventory, and it can not only heal you, but it can heal nearby allies. This is incredibly overpowered. And then we have the second most useful mod, which is the Robotic Drone Cargo mod. This increases drone storage capacity by an additional, I believe it's 10 or 12 slots. It's really useful. So let's go ahead and get the drone out, and I'll show you. You place it just like any normal item, and then it'll follow you around. Now there's a few commands. You can actually have it stay. You can pick it up just like a normal vehicle. You can pin code it, you can lock it, you can repair it. You can actually talk to it, which is kind of weird. And then it has storage. Now, you can store anything on this guy. It's really useful just to have him carry your stuff around. But like I said before, if you have that medic mod, you can load him up with a bunch of, uh, a bunch of healing items. And he'll heal you and your party. If you go into talk... That's how you get to that option, because whenever you first deploy him, he's only going to heal you. So hit the talk button and tell it to heal your allies, and that will switch the AI over, and now he'll heal anyone in the vicinity who's been damaged past a certain point. And this works really well, because he'll only heal if you, say, take a considerable amount of damage, like if you're at half health or below. So it's not going to waste all of your healing items. Anyways, that's everything about the robotic drone. I hope this video helped somebody out. Uh, leave a comment down below and let me know what videos you guys want to see me make next about 7 Days to Die. And until next time, we will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.